News on 6 reporter Katira Winfrey is live with the details. Katira. Dave, police have just cleared the scene in about the last 10 minutes. So although this section was blocked off, you can see traffic is running smoothly and police have removed all of the debris and they've even hosed down that part of the road where the accident happened. And police believe the man likely died almost immediately. The accident happened just before 10 a.m. The video shows how the lumber is cut across and through the windshield. Police say a flatbed truck was turning south onto Sheridan with an insecure load when the lumber truck turned the corner the small red truck happened to be right there and the lumber hit him. When the pieces of lumber fell out, some fell in the street, but again, that one piece pierced the windshield of the red truck. Police say this is a highly traveled industrial area, but this accident shows why there's ordinances on the books requiring drivers to make sure their cargo is secure. When you're driving any vehicle and you're transporting a load, that load can come off at any time if it's not secured properly. And it may not kill somebody, but it could lead to a serious accident uh, where people are seriously injured, or they could be, I mean, it could lead to a, a, a death. And police say the lumber truck driver has been taken to the police department to get his blood drawn. It'll be up to prosecutors to determine whether or not to file charges. As for the victim, all we know now is that he's a man in his 50s, and police expect to release his name when they notify his next of kin. Reporting live in Tulsa, Katira Winfrey, News on 6.